Hey everyone and welcome to another episode of Flop It University and today we're going to be talking about color grading and a cool technique to speed up your process. Okay, so now we're on on to the the cool stuff, uh, the grading. I want you to ignore the. Um, I think my capture card actually, you know, lowered the resolution. Everything looks kind of digital here, but I'm gonna show these images at the end so you can see how they look in uh, full resolution, so you get a better idea. So basically, this trick, this technique here, is using adjustment layers to actually blend different looks together. And I, it's important to note that this can work for Lumetri, like that's that comes with Premiere, and also uh, any type of preset, you know, effects like three-way color and all that stuff. But I use Looks because it's easy, it's um, it's clean, and I just love using it because all my presets is in there that I create. So um, first, you're gonna do is create an adjustment layer, and to do that, you got to go to New Item and Adjustment Layer. And this will give you an adjustment layer, and all it is is just a black, black file, and it's just you know affects what's underneath it. So, um, and the funny thing with looks is that if you add it to the adjustment layer first, you won't see what look you're getting. So you have to add the looks file, I mean the looks effect to the actual video. So right here, I'm gonna click the um, the video, go to effects, uh, type in looks and it should come up yep and I'm gonna add it to here to the video file um, click edit and then you get the looks builder and on the side these are my presets that's available available for download but um, you can use any presets and all you're really doing is finding something that you kinda like so right here I like um, you know I think maybe uh, the cinema profile it warms it up. I kind of like the warm. Uh, get rid of that uh, vignette and add it to here. So now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to copy it, delete it off of the video file, and just go to one of these adjustment layers and paste it. And that's basically all we're going to be doing. And we're going to do it for each adjustment layer. I'm going to find different looks. And then um, at the end, once you have that there, you're going to blend it with the, um, the opacity, which is really cool because it's going to make everything simple. Uh, so you see, like, here I already have looks on them, and I have the opacity changed. But I'm going to change all this to 100 and show you how I blended them. Okay, so I have all of my um, looks Add it onto the adjustment layers. They're all at 100 opacity, and you see how crazy it looks on the side. Um, but we can start adjusting the opacity and then start getting a good look. So right here, you see all this crazy stuff on the side. I'm going to bring this down to maybe about here. As you can see, I like the green and how it's not too crazy but I love how the green tree is popping out so in here I think I have a warm um, preset I'm gonna just bring this down a little bit to kinda cool it off a little bit yep. and the top layer I have a a cool preset um, you know kind of a blue but I wanna bring that out a little bit because it's definitely a daytime and I wanna keep it up a little bit and uh, maybe a little bit more a little bit more. That's about cool. So now I already have a look, and all I did was just throw different uh, presets down on these adjustment layers and end up change their opacity just to kind of get it where I want. Uh, and that's basically it. It's just throwing looks down there, throwing different presets, and then mixing them. But make sure you do you throwing down um, presets that you like. You know, if you like 
to go a little bit of orange or like you know kind of warm you throw that preset down and then you go to the next one maybe cool it off in a little bit uh, but remember when you're using magic bullet looks you have to add it to the video file first um, you know grab one of these presets copy it and then paste it onto one of these adjustment layers um, and I'm gonna show you some other uh, files I did this to so uh, this is a shot from the fallen that we did one of my favorite shots um, as you see here I got a warm preset on this one I have a cool preset on this one and then this is my favorite preset um, my silver stock and I have that on the top and all I did was just blended them and you see here it warms up a little bit uh, then I went in the opposite direction kind of cool it down and then my silver star gives that feel I like and then you know darkens it a little bit and that's it that's all I did and you just mess with the opacity and that's it um, see here same thing with this uh, all I did was the bottom layer I think I have it a little bit warm so that brings the warmth out and then you know a little bit of blue on the side and then that's about it and just looking at this final shot right here uh, you can see how okay I'm gonna turn them all off and you see this how I started and then I just started putting presets on and then blending them right here you see I have this at a little nine it's just a little bit all I'm doing is affecting opacity and then just making a mix and that's it um, so again just to recap the video file throw some adjustment layers down add a preset on each one or any type of um, effect on each one and then blend them with the opacity and again this works with lumetry or any type of um, grading effect that comes with um, Premiere or After Effects. After Effects is the same basic principle. Please like, comment, subscribe, share, all that good stuff as we're going to be putting out some more tutorials um, and see you soon.